Here's a newer liquid box fam. It's still a very good one. This one is a model 223. It's from 1993. It's in overall really good shape. Frame's nice and straight. Your grills aren't the best in the world. Uh, they really weren't a whole lot better when I got the fan five or so years ago. Uh, the front grill was perfect, but it got one tiny little area right there. No big deal. Let's go ahead and flip it around. This thing's back grill just got mangled over the years. I have no idea how this happened to it. I really don't. But it got all busted down there. got all busted there. It got really busted up right there. Got chunks gone. I I really have no idea how all the damage got done to this fan. Because if I remember correctly, when I got it, that was the only vent missing. And then all this happened in my owning it. I have no idea where the heck all that came from. This fan was the first year of Liquid Box fan to use the small vents instead of the round oval ones. Sand used a Macmillan brand motor, as all these did at this time. Right, let's go ahead and fire it up on low speed. It's a really good quiet running fan. I think at the time I owned five of these. I'll probably be getting rid of a couple soon, somehow or another. Owning five of them is just too many. I think I own four 223s and like three 200 eyes, something like that. I just have a bunch. I have a bunch of liquid fans in general. In medium. Really smooth running fan. Doesn't shake around like most of my 223s do. And let's go ahead and put it on high. These fans are far from quiet, that's for sure. Pretty good air mover. I just serviced this fan recently, took it apart, gave it a full cleaning and oiling and everything. It had been a long time since I had done it, so it really needed it. And it was really dirty, too. This fan used to get used a lot, but it really doesn't anymore. It's just kind of put away, off to the side. Maybe I'll get rid of this one, too. I don't know. This one's in pretty nice shape, though. I kind of like to keep this one. I don't know what I'm going to do with them all. Maybe I'll get rid of them. Maybe I'll keep them. I'll probably... There's a couple that are all rusty and everything. Those ones will probably just get parted out because they still run pretty good. Probably use the motors and fans that don't run so good because I know I have a 223 that's got shot bearings. And you oil it, it runs for about two weeks, and then it completely just, literally just locks up, seizes up. Like it had never been oiled in its life. So that's going to have to have something done about it. So, thanks for watching.